Hey, so opening note before like we actually start a video. So this level, I was warned, kind of has a flashing light thing going on and so it has two versions of the level and I play them both and uh, with the idea that I would keep the least bad one in the video and like make a special for the worst one like as a separate for people who want to see it personally I cannot tell the difference between though the two between like in terms of causing flashing lights so I'm gonna keep both so if now so with this series like I've always put like the time the time in the bottom like timestamps. So if you have issues with flashing light, before the start of each run of the of the of this level here in particular, you know, absorb the level for like a second or two. Judge for yourself if it's too harsh, and then use this time scam to to uh, skip ahead. Know that the other version of the level will be played a little bit later. Uh, I will make sure these are extremely obviously indicated. Uh, but yeah, I think that's the best way to go ahead with this. So, uh, uh, I made sure, like, I made sure not to just put this in the description and actually say this out loud and awkwardly put this at the start of the video because it feels important, you know? Health is important. Be careful about yourself, all right? You are loved and you matter, whether you want to or not. Still the best. So yeah, we are exactly at 40. 40 exits out of, I'm aware, is 50. We are getting there. And last time I made a mistake. Like, so last time I was counting three levels left before the blue. So that's not true. Because that castle up there already beaten. So there's the globe here. There's the skull. Then there's the blue switch. And then I don't know. Well, here we go. Mario Globetrotter. Oh, it's a three-man level with one exit. That's the Earth. Three people level. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we're at the airport. <laughs> okay. We're on the tarmac. Here we go. France! <laughs> that is amazing. Okay, so I pressed the button, so that was a cutscene. Welcome to France! Oh yeah! Da, 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 da. And you got all the Frenchmen here with their fake heads and smokes and me messing it up. Here we go. You get a mushroom, that's right, free French mushroom. That guy's got the bread! It's called a baguette! You might have heard of that concept. Wowie zowie! That guy's in white! Whoa! That's not an official color of Koopa! Unbelievable. This must be bad baguettes though, if like Mario's trying to... Trying to dodge them, because baguettes are pretty good. Like a fresh, real baguette. That, that is a delicious thing to put in your mouth, if you ever have the chance. <laughs> I say, like, like if baguettes were like this absurdly rare thing. Also, massive pothole. That seems more French-Canadian than actual France, but I don't know. I've never been there, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. All right, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna reuse your giant head. Yeah! See, for that guy, because I want the prize. Prize is mine! It's another mushroom! Here we go to France! All right, so these guys be chucking. There's a block up there. Is it a block I absolutely desire? Maybe. All right, I'll, I'll take the hit. Destroy this man and get it back. You cannot jump on this. Oh, oh, but, okay, so. That was completely unnecessary to do, because this is the way to that block, sadly. That is a one up. It's a white one up. All right, now we know more about society as a whole, as it surrounds us. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm holding jump, so I can go down here, maybe do a little bit of that, maybe do a little bit of missing. Yeah, missing wasn't part of my plan, but turns out it did not matter. Get out of here, French guy. Uh, I, I didn't have a better word to use, than French guy. I'm sorry. All right, well, now the Bredonators are in the floor level. I'm on top level. Here's building level. Welcome to building zone, the world of buildings and their zones. All the Koopas! Uh, that guy exploded. Hey, check it out. It's the Eiffel Tower. Oh, there's the exit, but it's not the real exit. Canada. I mean, I heard of Canada, but 
I didn't really think I'd ever visit. Not no, that's not true. Sasquatch and Dark Soccer stages in Canada. <laughs> I'm loving how it's just. First of all, yup, it's O Canada that's playing. Charlie's around, cause of course. And you know, yeah, the gimmick here is uh, enemy only blocks. That tracks fire. Uh, this hack was made in 2017. I don't think they purposefully predicted that that would be what Canada is about for a hot second. Press the switch. Why did I do that? So I can bounce on this guy and mess it up. Okay, but you do give me this. And you do give me this. Yeah, that's what it looked like. Oh, I need to press the switch again. That would be helpful. Whoa! Doink! Here we go. Oh, yeah. Off screen, huh? That's the way we roll here in Canada, punk! So if I want your thing, because this is scary. But is it dangerous? Yes! It is. Okay. Well, whoa! I didn't expect that shell to just murder everything. Alright. I need better control. Because we've got to contain this flame. So it's hanging out here on this fenced off area. Now you gotta do a jump. That is weird. So it's, uh. Okay, you know what? It's fine. It's, uh, the reverse semi solid. There we go. Right next to a parked car. Right here in the middle of grass. <laughs> Rust Valley Restorers! Hell yeah! Get out of here, buddy! I'm restoring this shell over there in my backyard. I mean, you can take a plane to go to the U.S., but I feel like that gets expensive. Although, Canada's pretty big. That was like in the prairies. Uh, and we seem to be getting kind of Midwest U.S. So yeah, I can see why you would want to take a... Oh, this is aggressive. <laughs> okay, uh, I gotta hit those switches. Oh, 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 thank you. This is aggressive. But... Honestly, it feels appropriate. All right, buddy. I need your help over this toxic... Oh, boy. Oh, well, you can't bounce on a baseball. The same way you can bounce on a football, sadly. All right, so now I get to do this, but without any hits? It's pretty good. Wait, is it a horse with no name that's playing? I think it is. The By the Band America. Oh, jeez. <laughs> What's my interaction with these? Yeah, that's what I thought. It's kind of a Kaiser Gate, except it sucks because there's, there's a guy throwing baseball at me. I look like places. This is a hot garbage mess. So yeah, feels appropriate. Wow, I... Oh boy. I need your help. I think. I need you to destroy this. Thank you! You even destroyed a muncher. Okay. I'm right at the right spot. For... Okay, I thought that guy was trying to throw a... Beekman's World at me. But he does not. He throws nothing. Do I need him alive, though? Well, he cannot go past... The blocks. And the horse with no name. And there's something peanut butter brain. I think those are the lyrics. It's been a while. Da, 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 da. I love that song. No, I needed him to kick a thing. I think he still will. I don't think I messed it up yet. I can just hang out. Destroy this man's neck. When you don't have a cervical part, you... Oh, no, the water! I tried to jump up. I was holding up too, but he still didn't jump out of the water. Jerk. Dang it. Uh, uh. I want the prize, but I don't think. Oh, I'm getting it now. What did I? Uh, well, and now I lost it immediately, playing badly. In the desert, 
empty and remember your name So there ain't no one for it to give you no blame or shame I keep forgetting Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go here I'm big now What will you do about that? What's my- what's the game plan here? I need to get the guy out, right? Uh-oh! I love Mirko. I just think has some kings it has to work out right now. I can only hope for the- oh boy, it written a few years ago. <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, that guy, so... I can just go here. And that- because he, like, hovers when he throws his base bomb? Well, actually, now I can go lower. No, you want to be higher, so he actually hops. Now he's just chucking. <laughs> like, that's really cool. That is a real- oh, well, okay. I could have avoided that. That was not necessary for me to get hit there. Am I too high for him to notice me sometime? Okay, alright. And now I go in this pipe and I go somewhere I don't know. Whoop, bye -bye. <laughs> We're going to our hack. <laughs> it's right up there in the item spiel. What's that flag depicting? The flag icon, because that little squirrel. Hey, we did it! We globe throttled. Went uh, for it to go. Honest look, buddy, friend, lore. I cannot possibly go on the other side of that. Go being able to visit three countries, including plane flights, to all of them. I would not complain. <laughs> I would be uh, enthusiastically happy if I was the kind of people that, you know, bothered to travel. That was silly. That was fun. It's so weird that that fun little silly level is kind of locked in between layers upon layers of secrets. Alright, the only other level other switches here. Ground of Disco featuring DJ Skeleton. So I was told that this level is pretty visually intense. I'm gonna play it now, and if it turns out that yes, it's intense, I'm gonna replay it uh, using the item that makes it not that bad. Uh, and I'll make the bad one a separate level, so maybe you're watching a second video now. I don't know yet. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, it's not that bad yet. I mean, I shouldn't judge that kind of thing for other peeps. Oh, block, block. There you go. How do you not hit that block? Yeah, I... Is it every time I jump? It is. Every time I jump, it goes... Da -da -da -da. Okay. Well, that's fun. I mean, you know, like, that's a pretty... Understandable... Well, I was like... <laughs> understandable gimmick? With just, like, this weird little flourish that just makes it silly. Right, you? Yeah, like, it's when you're in the air. Da, 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 da. That's when, yeah, that part starts. Da, 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 da. The can was around here. Ooh, okay. It's a really silly level. Oh, jeez, okay. Hmm, there's a prize there. Probably worth it. Hey, a fireball! A non-mushroom power-up. I mean, the fire aspect is not going to be of any use to anyone. Oh, they played a little trick there. Point. E -e 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 -e. Then you gotta just have to remember I'm gonna go on this cross That kinda looked like a down arrow But I can't interact with it So, uh, okay, maybe it just means I can And you need, you need a way to this can And you're gonna need to use this can's ability To shoot a bullet! That's the size of your head! Wild <laughs> Hey buddy, with a shell Buddy, with a shell! Da -da 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 -da. Look, I never played. I think it's been pretty clear throughout this playthrough. I never played Undertale or its cousin. Oh, this part is a little bit trickier, not gonna lie. Here I can see clearly where I want to be. Thanks to them being sprites and not being blocks. Uh, okay, that part, kind of hard. Like... I did not, like, when, okay, I don't know, there's certain distances that are harder to sort of guess, and that's a level! 
I don't know, was it that bad? See, that's the thing. I should not... I mean, the end is pretty bad there. I should not arbitrate whether something is too bad for someone, right? I don't know if I should put it in a different video, though. I think the way I'm gonna do it... So, like, I put... I, I've got... I've got time stops, right? I've got time... I've got time. I've got time stamps. I don't know if I want to replay the levels. The thing, it's kind of very, very ordinary level. <laughs> This is the accessibility store. Uh huh. It seems like you need to display the game, huh? It's yours, my friend. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and do that. I kind of forgot what's here. Oh. Okay. And now I have that book that I can read. I'm gonna read a book. Whoa! What did I just do? Once upon a time, there was a nasty, nasty level called. Yeah, I played that game, like, forever ago. I actually don't remember it all, all that much. Oh, it's the one with the, the purple, right. If you bought this book for a little cheap, this book has a spell that will beat the brood of a level for you. <laughs> That's silly. Okay, well, we're into this now. Amazing concept. Uh, yeah, like, honestly, it's surprisingly hard to parse those arrows. Uh, Slowly, yeah. It's the second half is uh, super weird. Yeah, and then there's the whole vanishing act, depending on what direction you're going. <laughs> this reads like a 1998, like. Game fact, fact for like a platformer that people were trying to do back in the day. This is what this reads like. Like some people actually like were not like very um uh what's the word I'm looking for here? No, they weren't like mechanically describing what to do. Some people put in like a little bit of humor, they put in a little bit of flavor, a little bit of editorializing. And sometimes they did make a little story out of it. That's what this feels. I haven't actually read the last few pages. Because I've been there before. What a relief! Yeah, alright. This, this is the one where things get funky. Bloody devil, do I get up, Dottie? Yeah, that's his voice. I feel like this thing is making some assumptions with how the player is going to react. Because here we get like the canon reaction that you're supposed to have. Might not match actual reaction. Where thou I bloody go? I have been blessed with thou I that I don't think thou is correct there. I think I think Scissorman is nice though. I don't know that. Like, I don't know that. But, uh, looking at the levels that Scissorman did, it's what I think. But I don't know. Oh, yeah, this is the third part, right? With like the weird like jump you have to do.
change in music is a pretty good touch. This is a joke you can do like exactly once and I feel like for this level is the right one because wow I'm just kind of I've been ready to move on I think I haven't played VLDC 12. I hope to, uh, but I haven't. Yeah, it's a yeah. It's a hopefully. Wow, and you're just summoned away. <laughs> okay. All right, let's re-experience gold, gold skull. But now wearing. Oh, is this really better? I'm not sure in what way this would be better than the version that does not have, uh, stuff. Like, being super real? I don't know where I am. Um, like, it's a... I don't know. Like, for real, this... So, like, I don't have issues with flashing images. I don't see how this would be better than the level as it presents itself naturally. I mean, I guess there's less light when you're on the ground and the sky. But, like, but also, I'm gonna be real. This looks better than the level in its natural state. So why not just have this l version of the level and leave it the year? Like, being com- what? Oh, right, I forgot about that. Like, being completely honest here? You l don't lose anything keeping the original version. In my opinion, but as a professional Mario'sman, I feel like there is a certain amount of value to my- Oh, fart. Amount of value to my opinion? That cannon seems a lot more aggressive than it was- Whoa. When I- rap When I played it the first time. So now I don't got fire here anymore. What am I gonna do with myself? Not have fire? I guess. I mean, that's not really something I can do. It's a state I'm in. I might die, actually, which I hope doesn't happen, but it might happen. Like here, this does not fix the flashing lights. Like, I don't know, like, again, as a person who does not suffer from flashing lights, I feel like having bright neon lines isn't really a, like, a good change. Like, this is going to be just as damaging, probably? No? Is it not? Is it not? I don't know. Like, that's the thing. I don't know. But... Huh. Like, being real, I do not think that the... Uh... I, pfft, music is doing its thing. I don't think this deserves being separate into its own video. I'll keep both the runs in the same video. People can compare. And, uh, I'll make sure... Alright, you know what? Okay. I'm gonna do something at the very end. But first, this level requires every Switch Palace Switch. Do you think it's a real level? 
Or do you think you just go in, the game is like, oh, you got, you got a switch, whoa, wild. And then it opens up the way to world six, the six sign, pop, come back, I did do that though. Yeah, see, I can run on this multiple square-shaped bridge. Yeah, oh, let's see, I know. So apparently, when you don't buy the item, you get booted back to the map every time you play. You press one of the novelty switches too. So I went back to buy the item too early. Because I interpreted that it would stop me from leaving when pressing the normal switches, but it didn't work that way. So it's just kind of funny. Like, I I interpreted it correctly, but too correctly. That is not accurate. <laughs> oh, Cal. Doesn't matter. It matters a little bit. Video games are full of bread. And here is the start of World 6. Our first step. The words, the end.